welcome back to my channel. Um, just want to come in and say that my third year of Christmas haul is coming for 2020 and you make sure to stay tuned and this video has a lot of chaos and me talking a lot so I'm going to cut it short and say like and subscribe and share to others you think will like this video and um, let me know if you want to see more makeup videos because I really like doing makeup and yeah hope you like the video <laughs> enjoy hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing my makeup routine and hopefully this is a really short video for you guys because i don't like editing i'm pretty sure i told you that in the past and something also is really different about this is i don't have my glasses on because i got contacts and if you haven't seen me on my tiktok my snapchat my instagram or anything else then this is new for you guys but i pretty much posted all over my social media which you have if you haven't followed yet make sure you do follow my social media it will be linked in link down below and probably on the sides right here um but yeah um so i'm gonna be showing you my makeup routine i did want to show you guys the products i used so i will be showing you that in this video and my hair is wet because i just got out of the shower and it's freezing cold so if you see me shivering in this video that's that's probably why let me know if you guys want to see more youtube videos like this because i really like doing makeup and if you don't follow my tiktok uh make sure you do follow that because i do a lot of makeup routines and makeup videos on there especially around halloween i posted the full month of october of halloween makeup looks and i just really enjoyed it so yeah um let's get on with the video okay so i didn't film myself doing my eyeliner but I basically went in the corner of my eye and just traced it upwards with a lighter shade. And then I filled it down with a blacker shade. Um, and then I do my under eye. Like, yeah. But I didn't film it because then I get nervous and then I just like mess up. So I just did it on my own and then I explained it to you guys. Okay, so I did my first step off camera because it's a lot of work and it's going to take up half the video. But I did do my eyeliner and it doesn't have to be perfect. I kind of just do it from my underline and I go upwards a little bit. So I do it underneath my eyelids too, so it's easier kind of. But um, yeah, I kind of want to do this off camera because this was a harder part and I don't like doing the harder part off camera. Because then I mess up. So it doesn't have to be even as long as you do your eyeliner. I use the Conspiracy palette because this is the only black shade I have that actually works well and stays on for long. And yeah, so I, the brush I use for eyeliner is like a double sided brush. So there's like a point side and there's like a fill in side. So yeah, now I'm going to move on to my eye makeup because, or my face makeup, sorry. Um, so yeah, the first thing I do is I do my eyebrows and my eyebrows I don't do much to it but I use this gel that I've had I want to say for about two years a year maybe because I got this and I it's just it's supposed to be clear but it dried out probably a year ago so now I use a hairspray so I use the rock your hair mega volume super firm hairspray which i got like three years ago two years ago um but yeah i just spray it on and then i get this is the eyebrow brush so i just brush my eyebrows up and then i do the other one <laughs> maybe from brushing my eyebrows i don't know so i get ipsy packages from the mail once a month and at my recent I've gotten the item Brow Chow, and I believe this is Addison Rae's um, makeup company. Makeup company. So it comes like with a little brush, which is cute. I don't use this brush though, and then just like to fill it in. So I fill it in just with my ends of my eyebrows, 
if that makes sense. And it doesn't really show up a lot unless you want a lot, but I don't. So you see how kind of fixed up so quickly? Um, yeah, I don't have much to do for my eyebrows because... I mean, my eyebrows are already okay. But if you do, I do brush them with the Benefit Gimme Brow. This is a sample, but it works so well. So I just brush it with this. And... Yeah, there's nothing to it. You just have to brush it. And I sometimes brush the front. But yeah um that was my brows now i kind of go into um like blush highlighter and this is probably one of my favorite sets because i love doing blush so i use the ofra blush charm and this was also in my ipsy package and it's like a nude pink and i fell in love with, that, with this blush ever since i got it and now i always use since i don't use um a lot of blush I kind of just put it on there like nothing and since I don't do a lot a lot of face makeup like concealer and okay before I go on I didn't make sense I don't use concealer and when I use concealer and blush together it like looks like I have like a lot of blush on if that makes sense. I don't know why I didn't complete that sentence. I had so much on my mind that day. I am so sorry. So sorry. Okay, bye. Okay, so now I'm going to do my contour. I only do my nose because I found out how to contour my nose. Okay, not the best. But now I contour my nose all the time. So I use the... Uh, Lovecraft Beauty um, contour. Um, there's no shade. I use it for freckles a long time ago. A long, long time ago. Let's just say it was a year ago. So now I don't do that, but I get like kind of like a f sided brush. It's kind of flat, but I get like a, si uh, a flat brush like this and I kind of just use it for contour now. I don't know how to explain how to do my contour. I just do it from here, and then I try to get it as, like, narrow, I guess. But I'll show you. So I get this um, shape tape, and it's in the shade light medium. Which is not my shade, so perfect use for a contour on your nose. Okay, so this is where I don't know if I'm doing this correctly. So I do it at the very tip of my nose. Like that. Then I do it here. And then here. And here. So like that. Okay. Then I blend as much as I can. That's how I do my contour. Now you can't really see it, but the fact that I just do contour really amazes me, so I just do it anyways in my makeup routine, even though it doesn't show up, which is fine. For highlighter, I use the Ofra X Nikki Tutorials highlighter in shade Glow Goals, and I've used this for almost a year now. And it's still in perfect condition. And I use just this brush. It's like a pointy-ish brush. I don't know how to explain it. But I put it in the inner corners. So like right here. And right here. And then I use this brush to also put it on the tip of my nose. Okay, and then I get another brush, and it's a blending brush for eyeshadow, but I use it for, like, for, 
for highlighter. And that looks like a lot right now. Like, but then I blend it with the same blending bra or beauty blender I used for my nose. So it's not so... See, now it's more natural than I put it on with that one br br brush. So now I use through I always use three different types of mascaras for if I needed them to be extra long for like theater or dance. So now I use three different mascaras. What I was trying to say was I wear four different types of mascaras if I have dance or theater because I don't have my eyelash curler on me and those four mascaras with my eyelashes really long and you could see them at least um but i'm using three and a three that i would i was using was i'll show them right here they were um the beauty gems mascara the vivian sabo um what's it called the vivian sabo premiere one and then the, the maybelline new york big lashes and those, I don't know why I didn't put them in order, but yeah. So I use the Beauty Gems first, and I use it for my top lashes, and I go in these coats two times, so Beauty Gems, I'm just gonna go. And then that's what it looks like. And then usually I would go in again. But if I don't have enough time to go in with the second layer of all of them, I kind of just curl them. Okay, so my last and final step is freckles. And for that, I used the Benefit Gimme Brow. But this is a lighter shade. This is shade 3. And I used 4.5 for my eyebrows. So shade 3 is a little lighter, and because of that, um, I can put it on my face just as, as like I'm putting stuff on, so like. Okay now, that it, okay, now that it looks extra crazy, this is the time you blend in, and you have to blend in a lot before it dries, so I'm just going to go straight into it. enjoyed the video and let me know if you like watching these kind of videos like me doing makeup um i promise that i'm gonna get straight to the point next next video um but yeah thank you guys for watching make sure you like subscribe and comment below and thank you guys for watching this video bye there would be a love.